This software development plan or Microsoft project comes with a number of working files. Those working files are broken down into their relevant chapters. And you can see in your working files section that you have chapters one to seven, each of those chapters representing the chapter from the title. Opening up any of those folders shows you all the working files that are available. Some of those files are not just Microsoft project files, but also image files or PDF files, or even back at the early folders, some Word documents that show you how we built the software development plan in the first place. All of the working files build throughout the chapters. Certainly some of the bigger ones here, chapter four, have a progression from one project file to the next. So be very careful that if you're trying to mimic and replicate what takes place on the screen, that you're using the correct working file and from the correct working folder. Most of these lessons have a single file called software development.mpp. And you can see that's in chapter two, chapter four, chapter five, potentially chapter six and seven but they are at different stages of development. So ensure that you use the correct file from the correct folder when you're trying to work through and follow what's taking place. Other than that, you should hopefully find that those working files are very helpful to give you a start point for each particular lesson and an end point for each particular lesson.